Hi, guys, and I'm going to show you how to make a halter for shy horses. Um, yeah, looks like this. But I accidentally got a bunch of hot glue all over it, so it doesn't look too good. But, um, another one that I'm making right now looks a lot better. Um, it's going to have a clip, a little thing right there, so you can clip like a leader upon. Um, so, I'll show you what you need. Pliers. You're going to need scissors, preferably big scissors. Ribbon. Any color. The ribbon has to be small so it looks realistic. You're going to need a horse. Also going to need a hot glue gun and a place to put it on. And you're going to need three little wire circles. You're also going to need a chain about one and a half inches long. Okay, so now that you have all your materials, I'm going to make a halter that looks like that, like I showed you at the beginning of the movie. Um, I've already started, and I don't feel like doing it again. <laughs> so, what you'll need to do to get um, where I am currently is you get a piece of ribbon that will fit around there with some ex with about half a centimeter of extra um... and you take two of your little things and you glue it like that onto the things so that it'll go around like that and then to get the nose band you do the same thing, only with the thing that goes around this is the nose. So you get a thing that will go around its nose with about half a centimeter of extra on each side. Sorry. Um, and should fit like that. At least I think, because this is only my second time doing this, so I'm not very good yet. Um, and then... And sorry, I had to shift the camera so you could see better. Once you have this, you get a piece of chain and you thread it through the things like that. Thread it through until you have this. And once you have that, you can get your last little circle thing, and this is where the pliers come in handy. Um, you get the pliers, and you open this up like that. And put a piece of chain through that. Only one piece right now, I have to re-thread it. Good. Um, if you're like me and you have to rethread it every single time. Um, and once you have this, you put the other end of the chain through there. And you take the pliers and you squeeze them until that's shut. And there you have your halter. This might not fit my horse, so I'll just get another horse and make sure that one fits. Um, looks a little bit like the like one, only you can make this come off. Um, and now I'm going to show you how to make the lead rope. 
Hi guys, and I'm going to show you how to finish the halter that I made. The chain is actually way too long, so I'm going to have to fix that. Um, but other than that, I'm going to show you how to make a lead rope for it. And what you'll need is ribbon, about that thick, um, pliers, scissors, your horse with the halter, um, and a piece of wire. I already bent it for the movie, so it should have an opening for the ribbon, thing for the ribbon, and then thing that clips onto the halter. Um, and I'm going to show you. You have to close that first. And you take the pliers. I have to keep on making sure this camera is on because it has a low battery. Um, you have to make sure there's no holes in it. Otherwise the ribbon will slip out and it won't be too good if you're trying to handle a frisky horse. And then you take um, about three or four inches of ribbon and you put Oh, you have to get hot glue, too. You put a dab of hot glue on the end, just a little itty bitty bit. Oh, that was too much. Um, oops. <laughs> um, and then you take the thing, and you this through. Ow. Um, and you fold it over, and glue it to other... You glue it like that. The camera's still on, that's good. And you wait for it to cool off. I like hot glue because it dries very, very fast. So I'm just gonna wait here for a minute. Sorry to make you guys wait. Um whatever happens to be watching. This has been pretty annoying. It starts my finger now. Okay. Um it's almost dry. But that's good enough. And then, from there, you have your lead rope. And it will clip on to your halter, if your halter stays on, or your horse is in your pocket. It will clip on like so. So, clip on. And if you have one of those clips that just, you know, you push it against the thing and it goes on, um, that would be awesome, actually, but my mom won't buy me any of those, because they're very expensive, adding some more, so, I just have to use copper wire, um, and, there you go, it's your halter and lead rope, I have to shorten the train now, because the horse will trip over it, um, um, thank you for watching.